<laughs> I'm Emily. Uh huh. Right. Okay. So, this is NSN, mm -hmm. the world famous news channel. Guys, YDCB here with some more Summoner's War action, and today we'll be doing the how to runes for water. Like I promised, this is work week, and we're going to do how to runes for water and some perhaps a guild war. But before that, I have some runes, you know, to upgrade. Like I've got a lot of runes. Like I've, I've, every time I get a nice rune, I mean, a rune that it's not insta throw away, it's not insta sell. I just chuck it there. I just chuck it there, and I realize. I have like a lot of rules that I should, you know, just upgrade to decide if I should continue chucking them away. Let me see, let's just look at focus. Maybe some upgrades for my bombers. Let's see, do I have anything that's... Oh, this one could be an upgrade for the bomber with the, with the accuracy and attack. If it goes into crit rate, I'm just gonna sell it. Alright? It's that simple. Like, I, I don't see focus runes being one of my preferred offsets for any attackers that need crit rate. Or maybe Hua. But then there's not enough speed on it, so... I don't know, let's see, if it goes into attack, alright, if the next one goes into attack, could be good, it could get 20 plus percent attack, which is decent, with some accuracy on it, which is nice, for a bomber, if you go into attack again, come on, even accuracy is not half bad, but just don't go into crit rate, because that would just fuck, fuck up with the, you know, what I'm trying to do, right, don't go, go into attack, come on baby, alright, never mind, <laughs> Why like this? I guess, I guess the focus offset. <laughs> Fuck that, I don't wanna do this anymore. We'll keep, keep that, keep that for future. Because rune removal day is coming, right? And it's like all of a sudden rune removal day is coming and then I realized I have a lot of junk runes in, in my, you know, in my, in my closet. <laughs> Let's call it the closet then, yeah, in my closet, right? So, today, how to rune water, right? How to rune water. Of course, we'll start off with the. We'll start off from the beginning. You know, if anything is decent, I will, I will talk about it. If it's not, just assume that it's shit. In my opinion, all right. In my opinion, it's subjective to you know disagreement. Whatever, <laughs> whatever. All right. So da -da 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 -da, skip, skip, skip. Now this guy used to be really good. Like people used to use him for Giants B10, but now he's just shit. Why did I even stop there and waste time? Let's move on. Right, this one is like, you know, there's some hype about him, like Tark being really nice and all, and some people even use him for Dragon's B10 for a super speed run that probably doesn't have 100% success rate, but I guess he's still kind of decent. Well, normally people just ruin him, right, with like uh, speed, like speed, crit damage, attack kind of build, right? And you can either go like Rage Blade or Violet Blade or, or even Swift, right? And because this one skills with... with with speed, alright? Increases your attack speed and it skills with speed. This is nice, it doesn't skills with attack, like the, the, the usual hell hell. And this one is just skills with attack and brings two two guys to attack as well. It could be fun! You know, I, do you think I should do a uh, attack Raok Lisa? Like team the fuck out of everyone? Like every turn you go you team up, you know, it could be fun, right? Maybe, should I just do this for fun? Maybe. 115 base speed is pretty nice as well, huh? Maybe. Well, well, well let, let's move on. Let's move on. All right, this shit. Oh, Kona Mia. All right, we'll stop here for a while. We'll talk about Kona Mia. How you want to ruin Kona Mia. Normally, people just ruin Kona Mia with Swift. 
Violent is okay-ish, but yeah, Swift or Violent, and you just go like, I think you go like, Does this like speed HP HP? Yeah? Speed HP HP. Do you need accuracy? No, just go speed HP HP with that. Alright? Just go speed HP HP. Go violent. Go um Do you wanna go despair for this? Actually, no, you don't wanna. Because this one it doesn't yeah. Just go speed HP HP. Violent Revenge. Revenge is nice because you can revenge and stun the shit out of people. People, right? Alright. Let's see, let's move on. Yep, yep, there we go. There we go. This is the story of the day. You know. Alright? Where are we at? Uh, nothing. Uh, Koda, and then we move, and then we sh this food and food. And this guy is actually pretty decent for beginners. It's one of the best healers if we just started on the game. Right? Because it has two heals. This one is like heal, and it's like, it's it's an AoE heal, and this is like a single target heal, which is nice. So it's like really good for beginners. How you want to ruin him for beginners? Just get like s s speed, HP, HP on him, right? Because I assume if you're a beginner, you're not really farming violence anyway, right? Right, so next one, we skip, skip, Illusia. Nah, just skip. I mean, it's good for beginners, but fuck, I know what. We're not gonna talk about beginners. We're not beginners here. We're all champions of the world. So we're gonna skip, 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 food, food. Oh, Purion. Purion has been, you know, a lot of people been using it as an attack bar buffer in Arena. Because this one gives like 50% attack bar. That's a lot of attack bar. That 50% is a lot. Alright, it's the most. I think. Alright, AoE attack bar. I mean, everyone gets this 50% crit rate. So people have been using, ruining it swift. Like swift, like as fast as possible. And you can go like speed, crit damage, attack, whatever. I think that's what people generally rule. Speed, crit damage, attack, and as fast as possible. Because he's 97 base speed. Right? But if you can get him to move, right? If you can get him to move, then he's got, you know, a 50% attack bar gauge. I mean, attack bar buffer. Which means your illusions are going to get that move because 50% is the fuckload of attack bar. Alright? It's like a, it's like 10 fucks load of attack bar. I don't know how you measure a fuck, but it's like many fuck loads, right? Alright? Let's just skip, skip. Blue Asher. Let's talk about the Blue Asher. It's always I always mistake it for Asher you know but it's the blue Asher it's bigger here he has a name he has a name like generally people just root him like speed I mean uh, HP crit damage HP or HP 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 or HP crit rate HP or whatever and they just go like violent blade violent energy it's really the budget Asher it really is the budget Asher he attacks three times Asher attacks four all right although he has armor break right but it's just the poor man's Asher all right but I'm not saying he's all, all, all bad. He's, he's pretty nice. He can turn the table sometimes. Just not too often, right? So skip, skip, skip. Rina. Some of the top players in Asia have been using Rina in Arena. Wow. Re yeah, it used to be called Arena. You know, A-R-I-N-A. -A, you know, because Rina was all over in Arena. Oh shit, that's so hard to say, right? I mean, that's so confusing. But anyway, some of the top players in Asia have been using Rina lately during the last 5 minutes. This is not because Rina can help you win, it's because Rina can help you stall about 5 seconds more. And at the top, 5 seconds during the last 5 minutes is a lot of time. It's a lot of time. So that's what they've been doing, right? Other than that, don't, 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 don't invest in her. Unless you, you like you, you it's like you're, you're, you're talking about you want to stall for extra 5 or 10 seconds. If not, don't use her. Alright? Let's see, skip. Uh, Wayne, Wayne, let's stop at Wayne for a bit. Wayne, like like Randy, is like really nice. Like all the bounty hunters, I, can, I think the win one is not so nice, but all of them have uh, ignore defense and chain fire, right? It's the same as Randy, but they offer a different buff, and he offers attack bar and attack speed, which is like a Bernard. It's essentially a Bernard buff, right? Yes, it's essentially a Bernard buff. So if you if you want um, like this buff, but you want to bring the ignore defense kit and the chain fire kit of the bounty hunter, then you do Wayne. If you want to have a copper, then you do Randy, right? So you rule Wayne like, but Wayne because he's an attack bar buffer. You don't rule him like Randy. You rule him differently because you want him to go first. So you probably get like a speed quick damage attack kind of build or speed attack attack kind of build for him, right? 
and you, you you probably go swift because you want him to go first, right? I don't think violent is is viable if you you know if you need him to go first. I don't think you you can get as fast as you wanna be with violent because it, one one oh base speed, all right? One one oh base speed. If you go swift, you benefit more from it, right? Because swift is twenty five percent of one one oh, which is about third. Fuck that. I don't know. It's about twenty five to thirty, all right? If champion skip. Megan Swift, all right, Swift, Swift on despair. I go Swift because I, I I want her to be moving first, right? Like speed, HP, accuracy, or anything. Like accuracy on six for the toad poison, speed on two. Get speed subsets everywhere. It doesn't matter what you want to rune for slot four. Preferably you want to rune HP so that she has a little bit of HP, right? Chemos, I even know his name. Why? Because he's pretty decent, de decent, decent for for TOA heart, right? Because why? Right. Look, this is like AOE continuous effect, right? AOE continuous effect. It doesn't do damage, which means there is no glancing hit. You will not get glancing hit. You will land this this continuous damage effect, two of them, right, on each target for sure, at barring resistance, right? But there is no glancing effect and. He's really good because some floors in TOA Heart, they revenge you if you touch them, right? And you die. And this is really good, right? Because you, you don't deal damage, they can't revenge you. Like the martial cats won't revenge you, right? So he's really good for TOA Heart. This is, um, no, no, shit. Shit, 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 food. This one, wait a minute before we skip the penguin. Let's go back to the penguin because of the recent buff. Let's take a look at it, right? Get us power for a strong, fast charge. The critical rate increases to 100% if the enemy's defense is weakened. Ooh, okay. So he's an attack type monster, but I, I I don't know about the multiplier and what are, you know what's the multiplier on this? Is it good? We don't know. Could he do a lot of damage? Maybe because it's 100% crit rate for this on weakened defense, and you have weakened defense, right? No, you do. Yes, yes, you do. Right, you have weakened defense on skill two, right? So. It's self-sufficient in a way. You would still need an attack buffer. Uh, well, what whether this is food or not depends on the multiplier. But let's say his multiplier is amazing, then you would want to give him like standard attack move, rage blade, attack rate damage attack, or even violent blade, attack rate damage attack. All right, you can go revenge as well if you get because of the stun chance. But you know, uh, just you just want to make him like hit as hard as possible in that one hit. Right? I don't know whether he's worth or not, but we'll. We'll follow up on that in comments. All right, let's see. Talk, talk powder, talk and powder. <coughs> anyway, <coughs> water mammoth, right? So his passive is like decreased. In fact, you know, a lot of people think that he's really good for stalling and shit like that. But really, if let's say you get him to fifty thousand HP, really, if you really get him, like you get energy, you get best HP stuff to fifty thousand. HP. Like, you know, if you have those kind of rules, you're in this part of arena where everyone hits for 20,000, so this passive is really shit. Plus, the siren like just shits all over him. Just shit, like the oblivion just shits all over him, so. I, I, you know, I, 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 I don't think he's nice. I don't think he's nice at all. But generally, I see people ruin him, like sort of like a, a, a violent revenge, because you can revenge and provoke someone. And just go triple HP all around, right? This is bad, this is bad. A water shock though. People it's like a decent photo farmer can do dragons as well, right? Uh how how do I think people ruin it with vampire or something like that? If you're going to be a photo farmer. But I think if you're gonna do dragons then you wanna ruin him violent violent like a like sort of like a wait a minute, why would people give him violent I uh, run him in dragons when there's no I don't know. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Additionally, inflicts continuous damage. Okay, so you can go like violent, sort of like, you know, standard attack, attack with damage attack or speed with damage attack kind of thing, or you can go vampire for fodder farming. But, you know, I think it's pretty bad. Alright, bad. Uh, water mummy? Let's see. Let's see. Fuck that. Alright, bad. Alright, this one. Some, some people tell me tractor. Like, they say some Korean. Players have been building tractor. Why? Let's look at that. Immune against armor break. All right. Immune against armor break. 
Attack bar fills up by 25% each time you get hit by a critical hit. Meaning, he would, if let's say you would try to Lucian this guy, he would move after the first Lucian. What happens if he moves? He has a um, provoke and he has a, a stun. I guess he can be sort of like a stun machine. Uh, but then again, if you're a defense type and you build defense, right? You build defense, right? Uh, and you do damage proportionate to defense, right? Then them Lucians, right? They, they ignore our defense is just gonna one shot you. So I don't know. I, I disagree. I don't think he's he's. I don't think he he he's gonna be really good. I can see that he, he can be good against sort of like uh, aside from Lucian, he can be good against those kind of like uh, Zyros AOE kind of team. You can use him against the Zyros, and he's like pretty damn good against the Zyros because there's provoke and like he's immune to armor break, which means. He never really dies against the Zyros, right? Yeah, it's pretty good against. You can use him against like Tiana Zyros comps, you know. Come to think of it, like if there's a Tiana Zyros AD and you put this guy in there, and he's gonna wreck that, right? Pretty much. Yeah, I can see that happening. You can ruin him like triple defense or 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 some sort of revenge, um, violent revenge, like you know, defense, 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 speed, defense, 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 crit damage, defense. They all seem pretty decent for for him. Oh my God, we're still at the nat trees. All right. We moved on. We moved on. All right. This is gonna take. A, this is gonna be long. Shit. All right. Soha. 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 She's a decent buff removal, right? I think it's hundred percent. Yes. Her buff removal. Her cleanse. Her strip is one hundred percent. Just like Chiu, right? But of course, you know, barring resistance and you know accuracy and things like that, it's one hundred percent. So you just want. If you want to use as a stripper. Is that the correct? That's how we, that's how we call them, all right, strippers in, in in our guild. That's what we call you know buff removers, like strippers, right? If you want to use her as a stripper, then you want accuracy. You want accuracy subsets on her. But other than that, she hits pretty damn hard, right? Like I would, you know, maybe this would be one of the 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 the, the units that I would go like violent focus and go like you know attack crit damage attack or speed crit damage attack with 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 like accuracy subsets, maybe. Maybe that focus could wait. Slot 5 rune can be used for something like Soha. Hmm, maybe. Alright. Let's see, let's move on. Um, water nah. I don't I don't like her kit at all. I don't like it. She's so squishy. Alright, but you know, I think that if you really want to revive her, she's okay, but don't ruin crit max crit rate because if you ruin max crit rate, she's too squishy. Right? For the freeze, right? Don't ruin max crit rate for that. I think just go speed HP HP. Right? If you ruin max crit rate and you go revenge, it's pretty fun because you can revenge and freeze someone. And it's a max, it's barring resistance. If you got max crit, you're gonna freeze it. It's for sure. Like you can go like speed crit rate HP, like you know, similar to like uh, how you want, how I, uh, how you ruin like a uh, Praha or something. Like speed crit rate HP, and you go like, you can go like this revenge, like even speed violent revenge or or violent revenge would be really nice actually. Yeah. You know, the, you know, now that I think of it, would it be fun to make a uh, attack my kin? Like a squishy attack my kin that just freezes everyone? Huh? Could be. But other than that, um, I don't think she's one of the better revivers out there. I mean, she does have a revive, which revives at 40%, which is not the worst. But... But... <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't... You know, she, she's just... The way... The, the way the meta is right now, I don't see her being strong on defense at all. She just dies like, just dies like that. All right, all right. Let me see. let's move on. Tyrone, like you can rule Tyrone many ways. Like if you want to rule Tyrone for TOA, then you want something like a speed, you know, HP accuracy kind of build because Tyrone's freeze is one hundred percent. It's one hundred percent. Right, and you want to go like despair because because this one has glancing kit, so it's really good for T Tyrone's kit. His kit is really good for TOA. Right, it's really good for TOA hard. But if you want to ruin him as an attacker, he hits pretty hard. Like I I ruined my Tyrone as an attack with damage attack kind of build before, and like he can hit like 20k on a Perna, like 20k on a Perna Arnold or whatever or Beast Monk, and you proc twice. Right, spiritual, you get a second proc on that, and that's that's 40,000. Alright, it's pretty beastly, right? If you ruin as an attacker. Alright, let's let's move on. I, I ruined despair revenge by the way for Tyrone. 
because you can revenge and proc extra spirit throws. All right, Lumi. I used to run Lumi. Um, speed, HP, accuracy, and got her. You know, Lumi is. I used her back then. If you're having trouble with Dragon's B10, Lumi can solo Dragon's B10 if you have these stats. All right, I'm gonna give you my stats for Lumi. The rune set does not matter. I use Despair. It doesn't matter. You can even go violent even better, right? I use Despair for Lumi. I use Speed, HP, Accuracy. I got 100% Accuracy, Max Skills, alright? 100% Accuracy, 50% Resistance, 170 Speed, 25,000 HP. She solos Dragon B10. If you're new to the game, you're trying to clear Dragon's B10, put it on farm on auto. It's a slow run, about 6 minutes, okay? But you will do it. Lumi will solo that. You can bring 4 people just to clear the trash wave really quick. And Lumi will spend about, I think, 3 minutes or 4 minutes on the boss. Or something like that. <laughs> I can't remember. Right? If you have 4 guys that will just die in the trash, die at dragons, right? But able to clear the trash waves in 1 or 2 minutes, right? Then you're looking at a 4 minute run with Lumi soloing the boss. Alright, let's see. What, what else we got? Nah. Nah, pass. This guy, oh my god, since the beginning of time, he has been shit. Until today, two years, two and I don't know how long have we been playing this game. When are we gonna say, hey, Water Joker, we can feed Lucian into him to skill up. <laughs> when will we able be able to say that? I don't know. This shit, shit for life. Scrub for life, that, that guy. Alright, Susano. Right? I don't know why this this guy has a female name, Susan. Oh, Susan. <laughs> right? um, yeah, he's also one of those units that that it's kind of it's good for Dragon's B10 if you're trying to you know get it on auto because of his passive. It gives him resistance 50%, which is really nice. All right, and in anti crit, I've seen people use him in arena as a speed leader for water in the speed water team. I've seen that happen before. And he hits pretty hard. Like this, like... People just rune him as a standard attacker. Like standard attack runes, alright? Julie. I, you know, I kinda wanna invest in a Julie right now. Because I kinda want a strong water attacker. <clears throat> when you awaken, she gets a leader skill. That's sad. I, hope, I was hoping she got crit rate. But anyway. This is like really good AoE. With Galen, right? If you have Galen. It's really good. Like, it can hit like up to 30, 30 plus thousand around there. If you're like, you rune like standard attack runes, like Rage Blade. No, you don't rune Violent, alright? You rune Rage Blade or Fatal Blade or, you know, attack with damage attack. And get some speed subsets to match whatever combination you're trying to do, alright? So, Julie is just, she's, she's really good now. Because now, now when used with full HP, she attacks six times. That's. A lot of damage. It's a lot. All right, lure is like the poor man's Galen, but it's much better in the sense that firstly he reduces attack bar, which means, all right, you have more allowance in the rest of your Wombo team, right? In terms of speed, you can ruin them for more damage. The downside is he doesn't give attack buff like Galen. The upside is he doesn't need skill ups to do this. Like, Galen needs max skills. He does not. And he, I believe when you awaken him, he gets, uh, ac no, he doesn't get accuracy. He gets a leader skill, which gives accuracy. But anyway, he's, he's really nice. I have 6 starred him. I used him before I actually max Galen skills, and he was really nice. Alright? But you need to find a team that, for example, if you're confident that your, your Julie is able to one-shot everything, right? If your Julie can hit, like, 40,000. Alright, if you Julie can hit like 40,000 from 6 cards, right? You can make a slow because because here you have something that reduces the tech bar by 50% and that is a lot. That means Julie will get the turn next, right? So anyway, wow, we are dragging- I- God damn it! Focus! Lure! <laughs> Despair, right? Despair, speed, anything, accuracy. Speed, HP, accuracy, alright? Shit! <laughs> despair focus or despair yeah despair will or despair focus despair focus is better all right next up this guy skip this guy shit uh, I, standard attack rules for sue i don't like her to be honest i don't but you can just go standard attack but i think you can go 
I think the rest of her thing skill with attack, it's better to go attack with damage attack for her because this nuke uh, skills with attack, right? Go attack with damage attack instead of speed crit damage attack and use like Rage Blade, Violent Blade, Fatal Blade, alright? Where are we? Fedora. A lot of people don't use Fedora. I don't know why. I think he's really nice. Look, let's look at this. Decline. It removes harmful effects. It's like the Water Delphoi. Alright, it's like the Water Delphoi. Remove harmful effects. Immunity two turns. And duo one turn. It's like the Water Budget Velodruel. Right? And. I'm a breaker. I'm a breaking skill that scales in HP. Heal recovery. Am I right? Heal recovery. Just go like. Alright, how do you want to ruin him? I would ruin. Um. I would ruin Violet. I wouldn't ruin Despair for, for him. I would ruin Violet. And I would go like a HP, 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 HP build. Or speed, HP, HP build. Actually, speed, HP, HP is much better. I would go speed, HP, HP for him. Alright? Let's see. What else? This guy. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know that whether he's good enough yet. No one has actually shown me that, you know, that it tested him out. That he's worth ruining or not. But it, I will assume they still shit, right? But he gets immunity against freeze and stun and sleep. Really good against like you know anything that freezes and stuns and sleeps. And it, it got sort of a mini anti crit thing, all right? Mini anti crit. And he gets armor break, all right? He has AOE armor break, random AOE armor break by the way, random, all right? And attack speed slow. And he's a support type. He doesn't hit really hard, so. I guess you can make him sort of like a, a non CCable. He cannot be CC. As in, he can be skill reset by Zyros, but he can't be stunned or anything. And he's AoE armor breaker. Could he be good in defense? AO arena defense, maybe. But let's say if we want to ruin him, I would ruin him like a violent despair. Sorry, Dis despair. Yeah, let's go despair. Violent or despair. I'm. It's a tough. Close one, right? I would go like speed, HP, HP for, or accuracy substats. You know, speed, HP, accuracy, or speed, HP, HP. Where are we at? Um. Water Samurai, standard attack rooms. Water Samurai, standard attack rooms, but I would go speed instead. I would go speed instead of at attack on slot 2. Alright? Speed, quick damage attack. Either fatal or rage or violent. Alright? Speed, quick damage attack for him. Because he has two skills that skill with... I'm sorry, wait. No. It's only one. It's only one skill that... But this is the main nuke! Alright, this is the main nuke! Alright, so I would still go speed, quick damage attack, and he gets a speed buff as well, which makes him super fast, super gosu, alright? Violent revenge attack, quick damage attack for selling, but don't, she's a piece of shit, she's not good enough yet, alright? Orion, oh man, how? How do you ruin Orion? Do you ruin despair, do you ruin violent? I think both are pretty okay, both are pretty okay, but... But then again, if you go despair, can you get him to 230 speed or something like that? Pretty tough. Pretty tough, huh? So maybe swift is also a decent choice. I say it's it, it's pretty close. Swift, despair, or violent. All right, and you go like speed, HP, accuracy, speed, HP, accuracy. All right, that's how you want to ruin him. What what offset though? Um, close. So you could ruin like will. You can ruin like. Focus. I don't think revenge is worth because revenge doesn't proc additional turn. I mean, if you revenge, you don't get the additional turn. Uh, uh, it's been tested, right? Malaka, fatal focus. Attack, attack, attack. This one, even though it receives like a buff, right? It receives a buff, I think. Where, where was it? Um, Blade fan, right? Chose a fan of blades to attack, and it, damage increases according to attack speed. Damage increases according to attack. It's sort of like a, a, a buff extension for this guy. Nah, fuck that. I, I don't like it. I don't like it. Gildong standard attack runes, but decent water nuker actually. But you know, there are better ones, right? Decent water nuker for 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 Gildong. All right, standard attack runes. This guy also standard attack runes. All right, attack with damage attack, not speed. Attack with damage attack. All right, when I say standard attack runes, is attack with damage attack, violent blade, rage blade, Galium. Violent or swift, I go. I prefer violent because sometimes you know you do time to loot, right? And one guy doesn't get the armor break, and you proc a violent, and you can armor break him. So I, I like violent, and I, I I like speed, 
and accuracy. Speed slot 2, accuracy slot 6. Slot 4 is situational up to you. You can do whatever you want for slot 4. Alright? Violent focus, violent will, which are all, all are pretty okay. Where? Where are we at? Um, uh, Tetra. Nah. Nah, sleep. I mean, re really very situational. I don't know. No. no. Unless there's something to, to really synergize with sleep, I don't think she's worth. Alright? Lapis. <laughs> I mean, she's decent fodder farmer, right? She's decent fodder farmer. Uh, and she's free. And she's sort of decent to break the shield in macro. But the multiplier suck balls, alright? <laughs> it's like really sucky. Okay? And. I don't know, you can go like standard attack or she's slow as fuck! 90 base speed! Bear in mind! It's horrible! Uh, you can go Violent Revenge or Despair Revenge, make her a stunner or whatever. She's just really, really slow, alright? This one. Speed, crit damage attack. But I don't like her, I think that of all the assassins, I like the wind, I like the, I like the wind and I like the, the dark. And maybe the light. Because of, you know, the light has some skill cooldown thing. But not the rest, alright? This one's bad as well. <laughs> not the best of the, the Neo Fighters. Swiftly attack nah, fuck that. I, why don't we why are we even we already did the review when he was released, alright? Emma, she's like every time I summon an Emma for someone, like I almost six star an Emma. Right as I was about to do that, a new patch released and increased the cool time of medical support. Which is kind of disappointing, <laughs> all right. It's kind of disappointing. But anyway, if you, if you want, you want to ruin her, you can go like speed HP HP kind of build, all right. She's decent for dragons as a defensive kind of healer because she doesn't have armor break. She has glancing hit, all right, and she removes effects and she has a defense buff heal, which is like Bella's heal, all right. But it's better. I mean, in the sense that because she's a support type. She will have a lot of HP, and 30% of HP is better than 30% of the target's HP. You're, you get what I'm saying, right? So, you, you want to ruin her like either Violent or Swift. You can go Revenge, you can go Focus on her. She looks really sexy though. I don't know, I have this thing for for this kind of skirts. That's it. <laughs> We're going off topic here. The blue and new base, we've seen him. The multipliers are really shitty. They are really shitty. Standard attack rooms, but then nah, he's really bad. This <laughs> is really bad. Kuh. <sighs> How? Fuck that. What is the name? Never mind. Uh, increase attack power. Oh yeah, this is the the. This is Katarina's best friend, right? You don't need a seek. You can bring this guy, Mr. Q. All right. Attack power and critical rate and invincible. All right, and you can do something else with the other two slots. Yeah, you can, which is pretty decent, huh? Actually, yeah. Attacks all enemies, attack bar decrease. And it skills with speed, <coughs> right? So I would ruin him like a speed, HP. Do I want accuracy? Do I want accuracy? Uh, reduces their attack speed. Uh, what is this? Attack bar. Yeah, I think accuracy is pretty pretty decent. Yeah. I would, I would go like a um, um, despair. I would go like a despair, speed, HP, accuracy. I wouldn't go revenge because there's no point. All right, there is no point revenging something which just attacked you, and re reducing his attack bar because he has, when he attacked you, he already has zero attack bar unless it's a vert, unless it's a vert. But a vert wouldn't attack you because a vert be fire, right? Oh man, my dream, my dream monster. This is the one net four that I won, like. I'm, this is the one single net 4 that I really want even you know like you see me like really wanting net 5 I think but this is the one net 4 that I really really want why a lot of reasons why first thing he's like really cool for dragons b10 as well because he gives spit but the spit buff <laughs> attack speed buff all right and critical ray which I like and this one is like he steals the beneficial effects 100% chance to steal it barring resistance right Oh, and this one slows attack speed. Oh my god, this is the dream monster. This is the best mo- my Oh, look at his eyes! They glow! Look at- Oh god! I, I want him almost as much as I want 
a net five that I won. Really? It's so rare. Oh, he's like the. It's like the. He's like the new black. I mean, he's like the new vert or Chloe for for for, <coughs> for this fall two zero one five, right? How would I ruin him? Oh, I would give them the bestest roots. <laughs> this is like a, a wedding vow kind of thing, right? I will give you like the best violent runes out there. You'll be so fast, you hit so hard. I promise you, I will take good care of you if you marry me. <laughs> oh, you know why else? Like you give him like I would give him like a a speed crit damage attack. Or attack crit damage. I, I'm not really. I would give him attack crit damage attack with a lot of speed substats. Either that or speed crit damage attack. All right. And he's. He, why am I just crazy about him? Because look, this is a multi hit three times. Right. Let three times. This is really big. All right. Listen, three times. Let's say you don't have the siren. Let's say you don't want to bring the siren. Right. And you have armor break on Theomars. The first hit. Procs and Dior, second hit, removes the buff, third hit, kills the Omars. Eh? Shit! Man! Come on! Look at his cape! If you, if I pull a chilling, I will wear a cape like that, and I will record the video where I'm playing with him. And a hat like that. Oh shit! <laughs> Alright, that's too much, I'm just, that's too much mooning. Let's move on, Camila. Man, your neighbor's wife. <laughs> You're never gonna get her. <laughs> oh crap, violence. Violence, alright? I've seen various builds on Camila. Violent Nemesis, alright? Violent Blade, Violent Nemesis. Revenge, not really. Violent Blade, Violent Nemesis, even Violent Focus, I've seen. Now, the 246 is really. There's like a diff There's many different types of 246 builds that I've seen on Camila. And they're all pretty legit, right? The most common is the attack crit damage HP type, alright? About 20,000 HP or more. I even seen the attack crit damage attack with 20,000 HP. That's like a lot of HP substat. And then I've seen the 190 speed Camilla from Little Ace. And that's pretty effective as well. Right? He goes like a speed crit damage attack kind of build. With good speed and HP substat. That's just fucking gross. 190 Camilla. It's fucking gross, right? <laughs> it is. Alright? Yeah, all, all of them are pretty legit. Alright? All of them are pretty legit builds. <clears throat> Varad, Despair or Violet. Despair is actually really better because, like, if you get the, the stun when we, do, we reduce the attack bar to zero, it's essentially just aiming them for, like, two turns. And plus, this one is now has a, a, a reduced cooldown, which is even better. Even better for TOA Heart. That's about it. It sucks pretty much everywhere else. Right? It's a defense type monster. This one skills with defense, but fuck it, don't ruin him for defense because he, the modifier sucks. Oh, I, I don't know why I'm so agitated at this. Because maybe because I have two of them. Oh! <laughs> alright? So you can go like a speed, HP, accuracy kind of build for him, alright? And just go like despair, focus, or something like that, alright? Let's see, where are we at? Sigmars. Violent Revenge is nice. Rage Blade is nice, standard attack runes will work, but I like to give him a bit of speed, like 140-150 speed, if possible above 160, right? Other, other than that, just give everything to attack and crit damage. Oh, Teor, speed, crit damage, attack, violent, blade, he hits really hard, like really hard, like a lot of people, like double Teor's. <laughs> Man, I, I, one day I need to show you this account. I mean, this my, this friend of mine. He uses double Teos against like pretty much everything, and it's fucking gross. It's fucking gross. It really is. You should. I, I need to show this to you. Like, if I forget, remind me in comments. Like, hey, some video ago you mentioned you wanted, you know, this double tear. I need to show you. It's just gross. It's just gross. Like, fuck him and his tears and his roots, right? <laughs> Praha, Praha, violent or despair? I prefer despair because I feel that Praha has like this ridiculous chance to proc despair, just like Chu. All right. So violent or despair? I prefer despair for the record. And 
<coughs> go speed and go quit rate HP or go speed HP HP or go speed no speed HP HP or speed speed crit rate HP as I this two of the builds that I rotate around when I feel like right and yeah just try to get more than 50% accuracy try to get as much crit as possible try to get above 25,000 HP at least all right let's see oh yeah did I even mention the rules despair nemesis despair revenge despair will they all despair and they are they're all good offset all right now a navel Annabelle Annabelle different countries pronounces differently all right I like to say a navel just like the <laughs> the one on your belly right a navel okay and um, yeah how would you how would you want to ruin a navel on um, <laughs> now I'm saying it totally differently anyway Annabelle that's how do we want to ruin Annabelle right violent all right violent revenge is the way that I would ruin yeah violent revenge the way I want to ruin Annabelle two four six many different ways to ruin seriously I've seen speed HP HP I've seen attack hit attack attack HP I've seen attack crit damage attack even and I've seen speed HP attack I think the most common would be speed HP attack that I've seen all right that's yeah that's so they all work they're all pretty decent I've even seen despair on Ava but I wasn't too impressed to be honest I wasn't all right Chow. he used to be really really solid because he was back then people didn't have the runes to to burst him down back then Chow could solo dragons b10 actually he still can right or giants I can't remember giants b9 or something like that like I don't know now I think that the best way to ruin him <laughs> I don't, it's like you want to go YOLO then I guess YOLO is still the, the better way at least he does some damage with like 20 plus K HP because he's really really high base HP by the way 30,000 all right yeah you can just like give him like violent blade Revenge is not really worth unless you're doing like a, a dragons and revenge is nice because you get to put continuous, continuous damage on him. Violent blade, like attack with damage HP, or you know if you want to just be an idiot, like a fucking annoying person, just put triple HP, slap him on defense, and people will waste an additional ten seconds of their life bringing down that chow, that final chow. All right, <laughs> let's see. Oh, the the the, the new Shiho, right? The new monkey. Not really new. They gave him an extra buff. All right, so he's he's essentially will have like a, um, he will have like it's a cooldown. It reduces the now 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 if you get three crits, you reduce the cooldown on this by one turn. And you get invincibility for one turn, immunity for two turns. This is a good buffer. It makes him safer to use. Still, you will have to use him with like armor breaker attack buffer. That is what you know sets him apart from the other two monkeys the other fire and wind one because he doesn't have armor break if this were an armor break right like the fire and the wind monkey if this was an armor break oh my god this would be one of the better monkeys right wouldn't it it would armor break and then you prop violent and you do this fucking auto ego attack and oh my god like you just one shot something right yeah, but it's not. And I'm sorry, it's not for those of you Water Monkey owners. But he's still decent, a really safe attacker because he protects himself. Right? And he's like reduces the tech bar. And it's like stun. You can go like Violent Revenge. You can go like sort of like a attack crit damage HP. Attack crit damage attack if you can go the HP substats. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm just. I haven't eaten breakfast yet. I mean, it's already evening because. I haven't. I've been procrastinating a lot on whether or not I want to go for breakfast today. And I procrastinated for like five hours <laughs> while replying stuff, emails, and comments. All right, Ariel. <laughs> Violent Nemesis. Violent Will. Yeah, they all work. Speed HP, HP kind of build. Don't go defense. Really, don't go defense on him. Like you'll be tempted to. Man, can I make Ariel into like a nuker? No, don't do that. It will only hit for like ten thousand. All right, with armor break. Don't do that. Don't don't do that. All right, Chandra, violent revenge. All right, violent revenge. HP crit damage. HP. 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 Speed. HP. HP. 
I've seen old tree and I've I've been annoyed very 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 annoyed by old tree before so They all work. They all work. They really do. All right, Beth Vile. I don't think she's a decent rage blade attacker. Why? Even I mean this doesn't hit hard This this one does But now with the recent buff, right? You'll be able to use Gouge Am I saying that right? Gouge, all right? Every two turns! Imagine! I mean, she's like gonna be the best Faimon farmer ever! You gouge and then you, you do this and you proc violent and you gouge again! I mean, I can see her pre be, being pretty annoying if you have an AoE armor breaker to go with her, right? I can see her being, being pretty annoying. Uh, you can give her like a violent, violent, violent blade or something, yeah? Attack, crit damage. I don't know why I'm just turning her around and around. <laughs> Violent blade sort of um, attack, crit damage, attack sort of build. Yeah, it would work. Even speed, crit damage, attack it would be would be nice. Just really annoying with the the three turn armor bricks and the, and the skill recovery debuffs. Speed, HP, HP, Wusa. One one eight base speed. All right. Speed, HP, HP. You can go swift. You can go violent. All right. You can go revenge to sleep people. Alright, so speed HP HP, violent revenge. That's how I would do. Or violent will. Violent revenge actually, I prefer. Alright. Swift also will work, by the way. I said that already. I'm getting a little exhausted. It's a 45 minute. Oh my god, we're 40 minutes into this water. I'm going crazy. I'm going fucking crazy. <laughs> Alicia. Why do we spend so much time on water, Alicia? Uh, standard attack, rage blade, violent blade, attack, quick damage attack. Theo Mars. I like fast Mars. Right, violent anything. I go violent well, you can go violent endure, violent blade. I think violent endure is one of my favorite because you lull the enemy into a false sense of security by thinking, oh there's you know, he doesn't have immunity. I can oblivion him. Boom! Resistance! And you win. <laughs> right? You see that happen to me all the time. Right? Speed crit damage attack is my favorite build for him. Some people go attack crit damage attack. Whatever. I, there is no right and wrong. I just prefer Fast Mars, alright? Poseidon. Poseidon, let's see. There's a buff removal, right? I think. Is, is there? Attacks all enemies, decreases, and slowing their attack speed. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. You can go either Violent or Despair. Violent or Despair, and you can go like Speed, HP. He doesn't really hit hard. And you can go Revenge as well, and transfer the weakening effects back to the enemy. Like, you can go Violent Revenge or Despair Revenge, and you can go like Speed, HP, Accuracy, okay? Last one, we're the last one. Bastet. Bastet! Did we just get one for someone recently? Alright, attacks enemy, taunting it for two turns. Single target provoke, and you can shield. You get a shield, right? You get a shield. Yes, you get a shield for two turns. Attacks all enemies three times. Alright, this is the pretty nice thing. You can land all three debuffs, which is nice. And this one's attack power debuff. You can just do speed, HP, HP, violent will, violent revenge. Alright? Violent revenge, violent will, speed, HP, HP. Yes! We are done! Oh, we are done, we are done, we are not fucking done. <laughs> oh my god. Alright, let's do some Guild Wars. Let's do some Guild Wars. It's like 2 a.m. I'm waiting for for my McDonald's supper to arrive. Yeah, you know, I like to eat a sup I, I like to eat supper before I go to bed, right? And uh, I've got this Guild Wars gonna expire, right? I can pretty much do anything anyone I want, I'll do because I don't have to worry about towers anymore. I'll do one, two, three, alright? Let's do the best number one, the best number two, I mean the best plus one, the best plus two, and the best plus three. Alright? <clears throat> this guy farmed me on reset day. Yeah. And every guild war, this guy hits me. It's time to take revenge. I'm sorry. I need one. Alright? It's time to take revenge. Let's take a look at this. First one. We can't bomb because it's Veramos. Wombo. Perna could 1v3 us. You know, it it could happen. It really could happen. What else can we do? Can we can can we go can we go rogue? Trevor? Can we do rogue Trevor and 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 uh No. We can go Trevor, yes. But we need the Sarion. Yes, we need the Sarion for this one. For the second one we can just copper that, right? Actually no, the second one we can't really copper because there is there is um there is uh there is Praha there actually. We can't copper that. Yeah, we can't. 
However, um, we can Ramagust that one. So the first one, I'm gonna go Trevor. All right. First one, I'm gonna go Trevor. Right, because Retash does AOE, Veramos does AOE. Trevor will benefit from that. You know, all that AOE shit that's going on. All right. And then we do this. Oh, actually, this is risky. Because, I know, I know. I'm like, make up your fucking mind, man. I think in the end, we'll have to do this. Even though I didn't wanna. I, I you know, because we need immunity. Because what happens if Retash armor breaks Trevor? I'm fucked. I'm literally, literally fucked. So I can't do that. So I, I do this and we'll go with Roxena, alright? Roxena, because Roxena brings armor break and he's fire, right? He's an attacker that has armor break. So we'll immunity, armor break, and heals. How about this one? Oh, we don't have Ram, we don't have Vela Jewel for, for. We don't have Vela Jewel then. Yeah, we don't have Vela Jewel anymore for this one to give immunity. What else can we do? Lisa? Lisa sounds okay. Lisa sounds okay after 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 the Yeah Lisa sounds No no Lisa doesn't heal, right? If I use Ramagos and Lisa and Kumar, is it possible? No, too dangerous. Possible but too dangerous. Way too dangerous. For you know. Too dangerous. Actually I don't know whether it can work or not. You know it's bombable. Right? It's highly bombable, right? Should I YOLO bomb this? Like, just go, you know, this. And let, let me try. I've never tried YOLO bombing this before. You know? And it's been a while since we used our YOLO bomb comp, right? So why don't we give it a go? Let's give it a go and see whether it works or not. I mean, if it's real rules, then fuck me. I mean, it's, it's in midweek. You know, I'm not goofing around, but let's give it a go. And let's see. Because, I mean, on paper, there is no... Immunity. It should be bombable, right? How about this one? Firstly, firstly for this one, I want to get immunity up, right? I get immunity up first. Um, I'm not gonna buff now. I'm gonna try just kill Perna twice. All right, just gonna try. Good. We got armor break on. We got armor break on. We do this now. Oh crap! That ah, forgot about Veramos taking armor break off. Our immunity is gone. This is not cool. Not cool! Not cool, Rob! No crit! Not cool, I'm a brick! Oh my god! Not cool! What? Shit, no crit from Rob! Oh, what the fuck, man? We need to kill this Perna ASAP and we. I don't know, we don't have a healer anymore, I don't think. Oh my god, no proc. Can, can you crit? I'm proc a violin. Oh my god, that's too tanky. I, should I save him? Should I save him? Fuck, too late. Too late. Too late. Oh god. Alright, alright. This is working because Megan's faster. I mean, we're faster, right? My dogs? My dogs are going crazy for some reason. My McDonald's shouldn't be arriving. Hey, I just ordered it five minutes ago. Every anyway, six bombs! <laughs> six bombs, six bombs. All right, we, we're gonna win. We're gonna win. All of them are gonna die. Like all of them are gonna. <laughs> they're dead. Everyone's dead. Everyone is dead. All right, everyone's unless this Kumar survives. Oh! <laughs> oh, he survived. I mean, we lost Oak and Chasun. Fine. Let's see what else we got. Let's do the best plus two. Waka ka 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 ka. <laughs> Let's do it. What we got? Oh, this first one's Bombable as well. Eh? It's Bombable the first one, but he's a speed leader. But do I care? I don't think it's. You no, know, wait a minute. Speed leader and Jutan is usually really fast. It. I might die. I. I should. I know. I. I will not. Uh, bomb it. I will wombo it. All right. I will wombo it. Instead of bombing, I'm gonna wombo. All right. Yeah. This is what I'm gonna do. This one here. Um, we do this and this. And uh, should I go Pra or should I go Akila? I'm thinking Akila could do the job because Akila's win. It's not as safe, but we get a chance to stun. Uh, we get a chance to stun Orion as well. I mean, Pra can also stun. Don't get me wrong. 
Actually, I should have gone pra. This is stupid. I should have gone pra. Why did I take that risk there? I should have gone pra. That will be the best choice. Alright, let's see. Now we do this. Uh, apparently, I could have bombed this. Because he's not as fast as I thought he would be. He really isn't. I thought he would be faster, but he's not. And because he's not, um, Asher's the only one going to be alive after this. He's going to heal himself. We're going to pr proceed to armor break him. And just kill him. Like, he can't do anything. He's dead. He's dead. Alright, this is really quick. Alright, how about this one? Okay, Chloe does laser. Chloe does laser. He didn't do harmless prank. Oh, additional turn. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. We do this. And then we do this. <laughs> nice. Alright, nice. Now he does this. Fly, fly. We do this. I don't care. I just want to kill Chloe. I just want to kill... Come on, come on. Give me a violent prop. Oh, armor break on turn. First one. Awesome, which is a bit more! Oh, violent prop! <laughs> alright, alright, alright. Harmless prank now. Too late, bro. Too late. This is the reason why I'm not doing Orion because he's not consistent enough, right? It's the AI, yeah, I don't know. I, I don't. I, it's not often that I see Orion do harmless prank turn one. I mean, occasionally he does that and there is a chance he could fuck things up. There is a chance. But the chance is like so small that. Is it really worth having Orion on defense? My duties may may think may may argue differently. May think that I, I don't know. Yet I mean it's still up in the air. But chances are it's gonna it's gonna be Bernard, right? Because I want to play double Lucian Bernard. I don't have a Bernard. All right, let's see what do we do here. I don't have Bella Jewel anymore. Uh, I'm gonna copper Randy the second one. All right, I'm gonna copper Randy the second one. Can I just bomb the first one? <laughs> Can I just bomb the first one? I bit my... Oh, I bit my gum. Fuck. I'm gonna cover Randy the second one. Alright? Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. And, uh... Oh, actually, am I? Let's go for it. How about the first one? I don't... Wombo? No. The Speed Eater... Perna can probably snipe something before we move. Because of the Speed Eater. And the Perna maybe has more speed than me. So Wombo is out of picture. I think we just play the safe way. Like the super duper safe way with um, say this guy and uh, the Saryan and uh, we go Kuma. Because we don't... Actually, do we need healer for this? I don't know. Hang on a second. Let me just... Um, I can go Lisa with this. Do I need a healer for this? I, I'd be better off with immunity, right? Because there's the armor breaker. I'd be better off with immunity. But I lost Velajul. Um I, I don't have Chasun anymore to heal. Um You know what? I'm gonna play it safe and go Kuma. Alright? <laughs> I know, I know, I know, I know like Lisa would have made it really fast, you know, much faster, but let's try Kuma. You know, play it safer with at least a heal on Kuma. Alright? We should be faster than Perna because we're like 190 speed, right? We're like 190. I don't think there's a way that this Perna is really gonna be faster than us. But the thing is, can I kill him? Yes, I can. Yes, he gets the revive. I don't care. It's okay. It's okay that he gets the revive. Now I do this. Just... Actually, I shouldn't have. I kind, of, I kind of regret doing that now. Can I believe in? It's important that I do. All right, the Perna is the picture. Next, um, I want to kill... I should just go for Elydra. Because... What's his face? Um, Galen is forever going to be attacking. Oh my god, that hurt. That fuck... What the fuck? Come on! Just fucking... Give me my... Yeah, Kumar's turn. It's Kumar's turn, alright? Jesus Christ. Whoa. This Galen hurts, but I'm still going to kill Elydra first because I'm already halfway done with him, right? Should I heal? Nah, I don't need to heal yet. Because the Sauron can still survive, I think. Yeah. Yeah. Alright, alright. Let's see. Now this is this is where it gets tricky. Because Kumar has shield rules, right? I mean Kumar recash. I'm not sure if I can pop recash. I think the safest bet. Right? Would be to pop once it's face Varamoth. Right? The safest bet would be to pop Varamoth. Oh god, what a crit. Alright, I'm gonna pop Varamoth. I should have killed. I should have killed because why? Because I'm gonna pop Varamoth. Who's gonna take Randy? No one.
This is so hard to get double ignore now with this this new change, right? It's so hard to get a, a you know a full ignore. <laughs> Once again, <laughs> I say stuff and it doesn't. All right, now should I should I finish him off with Thunder Strike or should I save the Thunder Strike? I think let's just finish him off, right? Let's just finish finish him off. I don't want to take any risks. I don't want to take any risks, right? Now we heal up and now we can do now we can do defense buff again. <laughs> now we can do defense buff again. Oh my god! Every time I say he doesn't do it, then he does it, right? Can we try armor break him? No, this compress armor break fucking sucks, right? That's why you pair him with Randy, because Randy ignores defense, right? Why didn't I have a Win Horus or what? The, the Win Horus guy, you know, it's like defense and crit rate as well. But I'm not doing him because Copper's armor break sucks, and, and Randy with the ignore defense complements him really well. Now it's just a matter of time before we finally get our procs on this guy and kill him. Yeah, yeah, like so, something like that, Randy. Something like that. Not quite there, but something like that. All right. If we don't get our proc soon, he's gonna proc like four violence and kill us. That's gonna happen. I know. I know that's gonna happen. Can we just crit him? No crit. Come, come on. No. Double ignore defense. Double no crit. Ninety-five percent crit rate. Randy. Good job, bro. Good job, RNG. Good job. Well done. Well done. Double no crits. Double ignore defense. This is a fucking joke, is it not? Huh? It's chain fire. Damn it! I realized every time chain fire zooms in, like zooms in the crit animation, it will only be two. And if like it doesn't zoom in, then it will be like seven or eight. <laughs> anyway, we're done. We're done, and my McDonald's is arriving. Let's do one arena. I mean, this guy. <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do this. Ah, oh, Tiana! Woo! Okay. Okay, there's a Chloe there as well. There's a Chloe. I don't know, will this work? Um, let's try. Let's try. Let's try. Where does... Where? Okay. Um, oh, actually, I should have removed Velodrool. I want Velodrool there. <clears throat> let's see. If I am fast enough to move in between Tiana and Theomars. Let's see. Ah. What? What? I don't understand. This Tiana is slower than my what? What? Oblivion? Game over, bro! What the fuck? Wow! I, I didn't expect that. I expected Tiana... I really expected Tiana to move, alright? I expected Tiana to move, and I expected, you know, the attack bar increase, and maybe I can steal the turn in between Tiana and whoever else. But, okay, hang on a second. Let me, let me just... <laughs> Let me just finish this game, all right? Yeah, but it didn't happen because what? I w like even my my villain jewel is faster. <laughs> what the fuck, man? I know, right? Oh wow, this Chloe is pretty tanky ish. Oh my god, this team is gonna take us a long time because my my villain jewel is, is not. I made him into a, a a tankier, less damage dealer. Oh my god. How the fuck are we gonna- we need a violent proc to kill this! Oh fuck! Are we gonna- Shit! There's so much sustain, right? No, actually it's just fucking Chasun. It's just my fucking Chasun! With the violence! Alright, no more violence, you fucking die now. You fucking die now, alright? Then we kill Tiana. I believe Tiana will be easier to kill. Way easier to kill than, uh, what's his face? That Chasun. So we kill Tiana. Like Theobars is taking a beating because because they're fucking all win, and I did you just did you just you know water Theomar, So yeah, <laughs> this fucking just soon, man. 
Fuck that! Can we up? Alright, no, no, that wasn't armor break. That was the default attack. Can we armor break, come on! Nemesis! Nemesis Chasun! Pretty good. Violent Nemesis Chasun, pretty good. Let's just remove that. No reason why. <laughs> it's not like he's gonna hit hard. I just want to put a, a damage of a time effect on him to, to speed up this process. Oh! Okay, we're done. Now, off this victory, maybe we get luck in, in our summon circle. Let's do random review of the day. Crystal summon. Random review of the day. Come on. Let's do it all, you know, our old ritual of, you know, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And do the little figure of 8 kind of bullshit thing. And go! No, wait, no, why well, you must double check? Of course! I already clicked. Oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Oh my god! Oh! I'm so sorry, guys! I guess, wait, this is worthy of reviewing, I guess. Bert, like. <laughs> so good! <laughs> yeah, he's so. Oh, fuck! I'm so sorry, right? I know, I'm so sorry. Violet. Violent Blade, Violent Revenge, Violent Revenge, Full Revenge, Speed, Crit Rate, HP, you can't even use him as Standard Attacker, it will work as well, if you, oh god, no, I'm sorry, okay, okay, that's it, how many of you are gonna be doing that now, <laughs> gonna be doing that, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, come on Vert, come on Vert, <laughs> Alright, alright, that's all the time we have for today. It's, it's like I spent too much time on the, the water howl rune. I'm sorry, right? So, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye!